In the previous video, we implemented the add vertex and add edge methods. In this video, let's implement two helper methods. One to print out the adjacency list and the second to check if an edge exists between two given vertices. Let's start with display. Display and within the method body, we use a for in loop to iterate over the key value pairs. For let vertex in this dot adjacency list we console log the vertex followed by an arrow mark that points at the adjacent vertices. Since we are using the set data structure, we use spread operator and convert this into an array. This dot adjacency list of vertex. Of course, you can also use a for off loop to iterate over the set for a more verbose log statement, but this will suffice for now. Let's call graph dot display run the code and we can see we have the three vertices a b and c with a list of their adjacent vertices a is adjacent to b b is adjacent to both a and c and finally c is adjacent to b exactly what we have in our slide of the adjacency list representation Display, add vertex, and add edge, all methods work as expected. Let's now proceed to implement another helper method to check if an edge exists between two given vertices. Let's call the method has edge, and this will accept two parameters vertex1 and vertex2. Within the method body, we use the has method on the set data structure to check if a value exists in the adjacency list of a vertex. So return this dot adjacency list of vertex one dot has vertex two and this dot adjacency list of vertex2 dot has vertex1. Ideally, if your add edge method works correct, you don't have to check for both conditions. However, for our understanding, let's make sure the edge exists in both directions. If we now console log graph dot has edge passing in a comma b run the code we see true in the console check if there exists an edge between a and c and we see false in the console our has edge method works as expected all right, if you've understood the two methods, join me in the next video where we will implement methods to remove an edge and remove a vertex from the graph. Thank you for watching. Please do consider subscribing to the channel and I will see you in the next one.